Dizzler, man. We in this good old East right now, man. It's a show day, you feel me? So just fucking around right now until we get ready for the night. Over here fucking my uncle and them. So like, I feel like Berkeley is an overshadowed city for sure. So people got this little perspective they got. But I mean, shit, we tapped in. But as a whole, do I feel like Berkeley and Oakland music scene intertwine? Nah, I don't see it happening. Shit, I feel like I'm one of the only niggas really that's doing that shit right now, I ain't gonna lie. Like, to be covered out of Berkeley, you gotta have, which I mean, that come with artistry in general, but you gotta have extra traction. Like, we not coming out of nowhere that's a hub right now, like Sac and Stockton or East Oakland, you feel me, where everything niggas doing is getting hella attention. Like, everything them niggas doing is getting attention right now because a couple niggas pop, you know, they bring their light to their city. It's like niggas like us, like, we gotta work extra hard for hours. I ain't gonna lie, they ain't really looking at Berkeley. So a nigga gotta make them look at Berkeley. Who said that bitch was a rental? Fizzler, now what? It's not no motherfucking riddle, nigga. It's not that. Hey, hey, look though. Last time, last time, there was all in the comments. They talk about, oh, yeah. We ain't gonna get into that though. Yeah, well, I'm gonna get into it though, because that was really, really, really disrespectful. That ain't no motherfucking rental, bro. We got that. We got that shit around, bro. Come on. We right here, man, with my boy Drew Banger, man. Really, the reason for this shit, I ain't gonna lie. Couldn't have, got this shit popping or really even rolling the way it started to roll or especially how it's moving right now without this nigga I ain't gonna lie like this nigga a big part of this shit for sure so my guy shoot man pop the truth like this nigga really kind of crazy like I ain't never heard and then you know it's, it's different rappers that come out of the bay but like everybody content kind of be the same so like to hear somebody rapping how they rapping and it's a story behind it it don't sound fake he ain't glorifying the shit that he been through, whatever. He just got a story to tell. I kind of just gravitated towards it, and I just, uh, I hollered at myself and was like, what's up, let me show you some beats. I was trying to get in the lab. And then from there, we kind of just started creating. It's way more than like, him send me a beat and I go rap on it. Like, we, we got a real like, he definitely then took me under his wing with this shit. Like he's, I could say he's been like the person that do artist development for me. Like, feel me, take me and help me craft my actual sound. You feel me? Then open doors for me to work with other people who could cater to my sound. Yeah. It was my birthday, and we was um we had went to go do some shit for my birthday, and basically like somebody else was like posting where we was that type shit. You feel me? And um, I don't know. You feel me? I don't want to go into too much detail or like specifics on this shit. But feel me? My car got sprayed. Just, feel like that when I was leaving my car got sprayed. Um, I don't really be talking about that shit all the time. I mean, shit, it's not a secret. Everybody know about that shit, but I don't really be finding feeling no reason to like glorify all that kind of shit. I ain't that shit regular life shit. When shit like that happen, they let you know this shit real. Like, this shit could happen at any time. And on the other end, like, it made me focus on my goals more too, because so I'm still here for a reason for real. I believe in that kind of shit. Like, I could have easily been up out of here, shot six times, stabbed five. Like, I mean, it could have been up out of here for sure. Shit, we right here still in the east, man. We at uh, Penny Saver Market right here on Foothill. I'm finna go in there and see what they got in this motherfucker. Grab some of my, my normal kicks when I'm snacking this shit riding around. I be fucking with these. I really be fucking with the ones with LeBron James on them bitches. It's gonna go crazy. They ain't gonna lie to uh, Sour cream and cheddar. Spicy, that shit be going crazy. Or I be fucking with the munchies, I ain't gonna lie, but I ain't, I ain't off them today because I don't like pretzels. When I be grabbing, I be grabbing these, but I don't like pretzels. And I be having to pick all the pretzels out and shit. I don't got time for that right now. So. Now we finna like pull up on my niggas, man, at the little, at the secret spot. I ain't gonna say where y'all gonna see when we get to that motherfucker, man. This is a little, a little too heavy hangout, man. We be, we be pulling up and congregating at this motherfucker, man. Y'all about to see me. Right there in the uh, in the BT, we going to my side of the uh, uh, my jurisdiction right now. It's Berkeley. The, the, the trials and tribulations he done been in, he really the Berkeley version of Fifty Cent or Tupac for real, bro. He not supposed to be here. He's supposed to be in there. You know what I mean? Niggas done been stabbed up. Niggas done been shot up, nigga. And that's why I'm working with G Pop, man. You feel me? He he authentic with it. He real with it. And that's what the Cream Team is. You know, my mission is to touch everybody who got a dream, a mission, a goal, whatever. Do it afraid, bro. Do it afraid. That's real talk. That's what he's doing out here. He's doing it. My guy right here, man. This is my nigga right here. Business, business partner, I should say. 
Cream team, cream exotics, you know, cream smoke, how we come. Two heavy family, thanks to cream, that's how we be rocking this. Check out the kid, man. How you open this bitch, bro? I'm looking crazy. Okay, let me know something. You better know it. We don't come light, we come right. We don't come light, we come right. Hold on, man, we got the official. G pop, right on the way, man. You know, shout out to the nigga Pierre BAC. Get the two heavy stamp on that motherfucker. That's what you, you know. The heavy clan. Putting on for this B Town shit. It's my boy Oski right there. Oh my boy, boy. Been on our way to the first show, man. We going over to regular zone. You fuck with my nigga Jim Knight. Uh, Kevin Allen, better known as Earth to Jerk. Uh, yeah, that's what we headed to right now. Right? Uh, it's the first place of the night. And after that, we go to Cornerstone. I wanted to see your shit. I knew I was going to do that. Put me in this motherfucker. Okay. This happened is, man. We just came from regular zone. We just turned that motherfucker out, man. And now we pulling up the corner store right now to go rock with my niggas, man. Zay Bang will be in the boy, Slimmy D. And friends, you know, we rocking in this bitch. We're gonna go turn this bitch up. And we got GT Toy hunting in this motherfucker live. Just finna go up. But they pin on mine when you go talk, nigga. Like we speak different languages. They say I talk different. I let niggas run the city, bitch, cause I'ma run the road. I know you got bags in, but me, I got them gone. And I you already know what the fuck it is. Two stars in the motherfucking making it big. Yeah. Tell them, tell them what you got going on. Yeah, man. We backstage right now with Zay Bang. Backstage. VIP. Yeah, I got my famous partner right here. Cut Girl, it out. Cut, live cut in the flesh. You already know how we rock it. This motherfucking man. It's too heavy. We're like, we in this bitch. All in birthday with this shit, too. You know, the hometown. Us. All in birthday at the show. Working. He working. Hello. You better know it if you didn't know it. You did. Yeah. <laughs> I ain't gonna lie, man. It's G-Pop, man. You done rocked with us all day. Shout out to Dizzler. We in this bitch at the corner store, man. It's the end of the night. We finna get up out of here. Thank y'all for rocking with us, man. It's really good. Ay, we really in the field. I'm dreaming about pints. Niggas dreaming about a deal. And it's fuck how you feel, eh? Nah, for real. Ain't got a rap check, but pour racks out the seal. I'm fully on go. I don't slow, stop, or yield. I only want